Hello everyone and welcome to the Noise Toys YouTube show. My name is Big Jeff Noise and these are my toys. <laughs> So today was another really good mail day and it was really funny because me and my wife, we went to Philadelphia to see her sister-in-law and I checked the mail earlier and there was a package already, but this wasn't there. And then later in the day, I had another delivery apparently from the post office. So I guess they're trying to fix all the insanity, which is beautiful, but they're doing like a couple deliveries a day, which is pretty damn wild. But um, yeah, I'm really stoked. I got another package from Ringside Collectibles. It is the AEW Unrivaled Series 2. Uh, again, I got two sets of them. So let's see what we got in the box. Let's see if there's any of the Chase figures. It's time once again for some trusty shank activity. So let's cut and see what's in the box. All right. This set I'm interested to see. Uh, again, I never find anything in my local stores because the stores freaking suck. But let's, uh, let's see these figures in person and see if they're good or not. First one up, we got Dean Ambrose. Uh, nice figure. I like it. He's too big. Um, but the, the face mold is really nice. I like what they did. Uh, the scar is cool. Um, I know it's supposed to resemble a certain match, so I know he doesn't always have like, you know, that predominant of a star, uh, scar, but either way, it's a really great figure and I'm stoked to have the AEW belt. And let's see, here's another Moxley, no chase, damn. Um, really good figure, really nice. Again, like I said before. Hangman Page, this one I'm really uh, pumped about. I like him a lot. I think he's a great worker. Um, I always really enjoyed the work that I've seen of him. But this is a really freaking cool figure. Um, I like the, the rope that he comes with, scarf accessory. It's, it's really sweet. This is a great one. This is one of the better ones in the set, I would say. Here's the second one. Now we got MJF. You know, my thoughts on him. <laughs> uh, dickhead, but awesome at the same time. Interesting. Uh, it's a good figure. The face mold is definitely the proper douchebag for him. <laughs> the scarf is really cool. A little more storage gets full. Mid-review. That's rad. <laughs> the, uh, the gear is really nice on him. It's a good figure. So I'll give that, uh, I'll give that one a thumbs up. That one's good. So, no chases in the case. That blows, but whatever. It's, uh, here's another NJF. That's good. Now we got Ray Phoenix. I uh, like this figure. Really good detail on the tattoos. The mask is really cool. Um, it does have the, like, straps on it, like, the long, like, uh, strings on the back. That's really nice. But his tattoos are, like, killer on it. I like what they did with the tattoos. Like, they do really good detail. And his uh, gear is sweet. Here's the other one. That's nice. I'm really glad that they all showed up in like nice condition. <laughs> so this figure is like, it's a great figure. The Dustin Rhodes, I personally always loved Gold Dust. Uh, dressed up for him as Halloween one time. I gotta find that picture and show you guys. Um, this is a great, great figure for the detail but the height is absolutely atrocious. Like, they made him as if he was, like, The Undertaker. Like, they made him so freaking tall for literally no reason. He's a big guy, but he's not that gigantic. It's insane. But, um, you know, I guess whatever. The detail on the face is phenomenal. His ring gear is really cool. Uh, this is the only gold dust or Dustin Rhodes figure that you ever see with his like tattoos. So that's a nice touch. Um, 
I will say it's probably my least favorite in the set just for the simple fact of the height is kind of bullshit <laughs> compared to the rest but um you know the deco is really cool but even at that like some of the deco and the other figures i think are substantially better like this one the pentagon jr amazing figure the head with the tattoo or, i'm sorry with his uh tongue yeah like hanging out that's really cool the tattoos on the arms are great. The deco is wild. This is probably... I'm, I like luchadors. I'm not in love with luchadors. I like the big guys, personally. I'm not too big into, like, flipping. But Pentagon is really cool. This is one of the top figures in the set for me. Um, You know what? Honestly, this might be my favorite figure in the set. Between this one... And the Hangman page. These two are my favorite ones in the set. So I'll definitely say that. And I, uh, oh, well, there's that. And here's the other one. So you can say two of them. Um, I'll probably say the best ones are, I'm going to say my favorite one is the page. And the runner up to that would be Pentagon Jr. Then I'd probably go with the Moxley and MJF. Then the Ray Phoenix. And my least favorite one is going to be the Dustin Rhodes. And that's really a shame because, you know, he's a guy that I always really liked and respected. Um, it's cool that he's in, like, another company that you're seeing a figure from. But what the fuck were they thinking with the height of these figures? Uh, either way... Amazing set. Really glad I have one, and I'm going to have one for sale, too, on the Facebook and Instagram, so keep an eye out for that. So that's going to be all for today. Thank you guys very much for watching. That's the AEW Unrivaled Series 2. Hope you guys enjoyed. Please make sure to follow us on Facebook and Instagram, Noise Toys, N-O-Y-Z-E-T-O-Y-Z. -E -E. Thank you guys for watching the videos. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe to the YouTube channel. And as always, peace. Thank <laughs> you.